Nope, it's got a thing go. Okay, here. I can have, okay, now try it. Yeah, you got it. Okay. Okay, let me create one for you, okay, Morgan? Okay, uh, this one I already blew up once, so it's good. Hey, folks. I'm trying to teach these guys how to make a really a handy type of thing that we use, uh, sea captains use, uh, when they want to make music and they don't have much around but balloons in these party favor uh, uh, things. No noise maker, see? Okay, and it's got sort of a Scottish feel to it here. No, not that. Now you stick this inside. Okay, let's see. Close it off and get it down as deep as I can inside. Now the movie we're watching tonight, guys, I might as well talk a little bit about it, is The Creature from the Haunted Sea. And uh, that is one of my favorite films. I love seafaring films. Okay, and, and this is about a, a sort of a, a to have and to have not type of a, a plot where a sea captain is uh, smuggling guys into Cuba and stuff like that. So let's see if you got, now you, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, there you go, that's good. And it's, uh, oh, make one for myself, and then we can have like an orchestra going here. Now don't, don't chew on it. No, no, you're supposed, the sound is supposed to come out of that thing there. Okay, just like he's doing. No, no, he's not doing it either. Let me get one here, and I'll do it by demonstrating. <laughs> Okay, now I'll get mine going. Here. Okay, stick wrong one. Okay, we'll stick this baby in there. See, and this this film here is a Roger Corman film from 1961. It's written by Charles Griffith, and uh, Charles Griffith wrote a lot of stuff for uh, Corman during this time period. It stars uh, uh, Anthony Carbone, who plays the sea captain. Okay, and Betsy Jones Moreland, who's sort of the love interest in this. And likewise, it's got Robert Town. Robert Town. And it's actually, those three were in a film that was shot about the same time as The Last Woman on Earth. Oh, okay. So let's see what we can do here. Okay, here is our, here's our thing now. Okay, ready? Everybody get, get, now put it under your arm like that, and then go. Okay. Now, this film, I really like this movie. It's a style, is sort of uh, kind of French New Wavy, and if you think about your 1961 time period, it, uh, it really fits in for the French New Wave. Uh, kind of playful, uh, kind of uh, satiric, but at the same time, it, it takes itself somewhat seriously. It deals with these, uh, these guys who sort of want to make a mythology about this sea monster that's supposed to be threatening people, and actually, what happened? And then it turns out that there really is a sea monster who looks like a pile of seaweed with uh, ping pong balls for eyes. Yeah, you remember that? Yeah, you like that one. See, now it's catching on. Well, let, let me get you. Here, wait. Take that one. Okay, okay put that. Okay, okay, now, okay. you got it? Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to make another one for myself. Uh, this film is, is one of those beauties that uh, uh, Corman was known for. Uh, he shot very quickly. Uh, and uh, uh, again, Charles Griffith writing the screenplay. He wrote a ton of really good stuff for him. Uh, and uh, I think, let me get my other balloon ready here. I'm really running out of steam here. I love the special effects for this film. I love the idea that it's sort of a uh, uh, kind of a what American version of a French wave film and like a French new wave film and it's likewise a kind of a kind of a comic remake of To Have and To Have Not without Walter Brennan in it. But it has the Carbone guy play that instead. No, yours? No, you. I'm gonna get. Okay, everybody. Uh, Carbone is very much of a Bogart type of guy. He he really he really has that look. So he can. Okay. Morgan, uh, nothing coming out of there. Uh, well, folks, for what it's worth, Creature from the Haunted Sea is a is going to be worth your. Come on, you got to choke on that. No, 
play this. <laughs> okay, uh, it's gonna be worth your time, much more worth your time than what you just saw right here. So let's roll them, guys. <laughs> you stuck with you guys is like, uh, that ain't the way you, you can't even play that. Well, see you later.